This vulnerability was discovered by Telos Intelligence and affects the 3S Smart Software Solutions Codesis. This is a hardware independent automation software for the engineering and development of control applications. The application of refer reference today is the gateway server known as gateway service.exe. It connects Codesis automation server to Codesis PLCs in a local network. The gateway servers can be used to create soft PLCs from arbitrary devices. Gateway server exposes the TCP IP programming ports, UDP ports 1740 to 1743 and TCP ports 1217 and 11740 and 11743. Communication is via custom packet data units where the sender and receiver message lengths are specified in the request body. PDA specification is closed source, but Kaspersky Security Research published a compre comprehensive review. And I want to take this moment to shout out to Kaspersky. Uh, I keep butchering that name. Kaspersky Security Research for the awesome work they have done in reverse engineering the structure of the PDU. So the particular packet we will be looking at today is the bulk drive TCP BLK DRV TCP PDU. Um, I will kind of be going back and forth between this slide and the following slide just because the slide has some coloring and information and we will kind of be comparing it to live data captured from the network. Uh, but just think, things to keep in mind, um, essentially this is the field of relevant to us, length, the lens field, and it's actually a single byte that kind of captures the the length of two things, so receiver length and sender length. And essentially, those, these length values specify the length of these other fields, sender and receiver. So ideally, if you want to access remaining data, which we will see how the code does, we first need to obtain these numbers, perform the correct arithmetic operations, skip past the padding, and then we can access remaining data. So let's take a look at what that looks like. Um, so for example, in the coloring, uh, deep blue refers to the number 53, uh, or I guess 0x53. Um, and that basically helps us to count the sender, the sender length, the, the sender length first, so the deep, the deep purple one, and the receiver length, which is more of a lightish pinkish highlight. And this is the padding and eventually the data that's supposed to be copied. The vulnerable byte is the length field, as I mentioned earlier. The vulnerable routine is gateway service, and we don't have our symbols for this binary, so I'm just going to give an offset, uh, 0x277d70. What this function actually tries to do is it tries to read the length from the packets, perform some computation to determine the offset into the packet where it should start copying the remaining data, and then it proceeds to copy the data. Pay attention to the first parameter, and that first parameter points to the actual full BLK DRV PDU data packet that we have seen in the previous slides. And take a moment to review the code and see if you can identify the flaw. 